first subscribers and friends, welcome to my channel. Look at this, I'm at the outside mall. Look at all these uh, flowers here. I thought I'd bring Jerry over here, I haven't been over here in a while. I'm gonna take him for a different walk, different place. Uh, there's some swirls over here I wanna look at too. Come on, you was in a rush to go, 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 and now you just wanna stop? They got it's really cool when you drive in. I feel like you're in Florida over there with all them palm trees. All right. I'm in Florida. They got all the Christmas stuff all around all the light posts on the outside of the mall. You come over here at, at nighttime and see the Christmas lights. That area over there is where the uh, people come and they bring their quads and stuff like that. But there's a couple of saguaros over here. I can see it from right here. Look how big it is. I'm gonna go to that one there. What? We're going. Just wide open. I'm gonna take him down in there. Go across. Hey, come on. We're going this way. I was gonna have to carry him down, but he went down there real easy. Come on, let's go up this side. Come on. He's an adventure dog. Come on, adventure dog. Let's go up these rocks. Come on. You can do it, adventure dog. You can do it. And these bushes here are terrible, especially if you're off-roading. These will puncture the sidewall of your car or truck tire so easily. Don't ever try to run over those if you're off-roading in the desert. Trust me, I did it in my truck blew out the freaking sidewall and I still have that tire sitting in my backyard uh, put a picture of it up here you don't want to do it I was doing a, I was uh, off-roading with this big truck that I had and uh, that's when I figure out how tough those bushes are Look at these two barrel cactus It's a little chilly out. Hold on, Jerry. I see a big swirl way over there. Wait. That sucker is far from here. See it standing up over there? Come on. Man, he's like snorting and everything. What's what? What do you smell over there, adventure dog? Huh? Been standing here for like seven minutes. I don't know what he's smelling in there. At least it's a nice day, right? It's not gloomy. We've been having like a week of just gloomy weather. Look at that Panther Peak and Sombrero Peak. That's Panther Peak right there. Sombrero Peak. I live on the other side of those mountains. I'm pretty far from my house. But the beautiful sunshine, yeah, man, if I, if, if it wasn't sunny today, boy, I don't know, man. I, I can't handle the gloomy weather every single day. It's a 360 view where I'm at. It's Santa Catalina Mountains over there. Like I said, that's the uh, outlet mall, the outside mall, we, my family call it. My wife likes to go there because we can take Jerry and walk around the outside with Jerry. Everybody in Arizona has dogs bring their dogs to the mall. Right adventure dog? Come on adventure dog this way. This area doesn't have too many cactuses but what it does have is tall freaking choya cactuses. That thing's about 10 feet tall. Let's go look at that adventure dog. I want you to get too close so I don't want you to step on these. Got a boundary we gotta keep. Look at that. One tall one. They got tall choya cactuses and then they got a lot of barrel cactuses in this area along with these. I think it's called creosote bush or something like that. So it's weird when I go out in the desert because certain parts of the desert have certain cactuses that grow tall. And like when I was out hiking yesterday. I saw the coyote, that area where I hiked there, t 
ton of freaking uh, toy cactuses. Look at this barrel cactus. All dried up on the inside. There's a train. A lot of Palo Verde trees, a lot of mesquite trees, a lot of ironwood trees in this area. Very few saguaros. Look at that one. Look at that sucker that's leaning. Wait, adventure dog. Normally I wouldn't bring Jerry out here, but because the weather's cold, not worry about snakes. There's another one over there I'm going to go look at. Wait, I want to go look at this one. I'm seeing there's a lot of trees and a lot of cactuses. They've got little... See that little flap thing? What do you call that? A ribbon? And this one has a ribbon on it also. Dangling right there. Jerry, I'm looking at this gigantic saguaro. It's not the biggest, but it's pretty big for how much it's leaning. Wait, I want to look at this. Oh, oh, oh! Kind of sticking out. He stepped on this and thought he had a sticker. Look what I found here. There's three of them. There's one here, one there. I don't know what it, what it is here. Did I say 45? Can't tell. Don't get my glasses. Wait a minute. I want to look at this. Look how that sucker is bent right there. It's like counterweighting this gigantic thing, man. The root system on these things are awesome. I say that every single time, but see a giant root there? I get new people all the time to my channel. It's still with all that weight. They weigh like 800 tons, these big ones. And it's, man, until you see this in person, it's just really hard to, to grasp the, the awe of these things. Look at it, it's all beat up down there. Because that sucker is leaning, man. And it's a lot of weight. You can always follow me on Instagram. I see got the truth Arizona. I always post pictures of my hikes before I ever upload videos. Looks cool. Hey, hold on. I gotta get some pictures, Adventure Dog. Hey, look at these two trees. All right. Look at that sucker, how that sucker is leaning. Alright, let's go look at this one over here. I want to show this one. It's not a huge one, but it's got some weird arms on it. I want to show that. And then I'm going to go over that way. And there's another big one over there. Okay, Jared? I mean, Adventure Dog? I'm an adventure dog. I like the adventures. Go hiking with my papa. Adventure dog. Ba -ba I don't know. I gotta get some music for my adventure dog. See, so look at this one. It's just, it's just so weird looking. I didn't have my camera on, but I was coming around right here, and there was a huge hawk right here. He flew, dropped down, and flew in between this and went that way before I can get my camera on. Wait, I want to look at this one, Jerry. Come on, this way. Look at the bottom there. It's an old one. Look at the arm, how twisted it is. Freaking twisted it is. Look, it's like fingers. What do you think, Jerry? You're not even looking at it, Jerry. Oh, what? You want to go see the big one? All right, we'll go see the big one. Look at it from this angle. Here's a gigantic barrel cactus over here. Come on, Jerry. I want to show you a sleeping barrel cactus. Yeah. Probably four feet. Just laying down. It's not dead, it's it just bent right there and then it's leaning laying over on the ground there. 
Come on, we're going to the big one, Jerry. I mean, adventure dog. I told my wife I was going to bring him over here. And she's like, you be careful, man. Don't let the coyotes get him. Hey, look, I found a couch. Come on this way. He acts like he's hot. He's panting. Look at this giant barrel cactus adventure dog. Look at this thing. That thing's taller than me. Come here, walk in front of it. It's got to be a little over five feet tall. Yeah, it's probably about three inches taller than me. I'm 5'7". Pretty big. I know you want to see it. Just wait a minute. I'm looking at the barrel character. He's pulling me. He wants to see the big sore over here. You see it? It's pretty big. It's not the biggest, but it's, I say it's in the top five. Just look at the, how the arms are so destroyed right there. But yet it's still, this is how you know when it's old, when it's like this at the bottom. I could stand behind that and you guys wouldn't see me. Like I did in the other video, that's how wide it is. Walk around this. Pretty big. What? Huh? Where? Oh yeah, no kidding, huh? Come on. Look at the flowers. Thank you, adventure dog. I didn't notice them before. There's flowers there and there's a whole bunch of them over here. He's like, yeah, there's more over here. Come here. You gonna smell them? It's nice to see. Uh, so beautiful flowers. <gasps> oh, beautiful. So we got that big one that's way over there that's leaning like crazy. And uh, that one over there is actually taller than this one. But that one's also leaning too. Beautiful, awesome saguaros. All right, let's head back to the car. I know it's a long walk. It doesn't seem like it, but it is. Up the hill, venture dog. Pull me, pull me, pull me. He said, yeah, I don't think so. Look, adventure dog found grass. Look at this grass. Go. Soft this grass is. Look at Adventure Dog. No, no, eat it. Very nice grass. This, he's eating it. What are you, vegetarian? Man, we walked. That's the first saguaro right there we saw, and then the other one's way back there. We've been walking about 20 minutes now. Come on. I don't want you throwing up in my car. Come on, adventure dog. You're not Popeye. I got him all cleaned up. He's thirsty. We walk a long ways, huh, Jerry? Yep. Hey, come on. Drink some more. I'm gonna head home. Still don't have a radio. I just use my phone. I have an app on my phone. 
uh, to the radio station I listened to. Mall security came by and just stopped right in front of me, was just looking at me like like he'd never seen somebody give dog water before or something. He didn't say anything, he just was looking at me. Anyways, uh, I want to show you this drive through these palm trees here. See all the Christmas stuff? Doesn't even feel like Christmas though. All right, heading home. If you like these kind of videos, uh, give me a thumbs up, smash that like button. You know, if you're new to the channel, you like what you see, hit that subscribe button. It don't cost anything. It's free. Right. Like always, thank you for taking the time to watch my videos. Remember, be kind to people. Treat people the way you want to be treated. I'm gone. Yeah, I'm 25 miles per hour. Look at this. I was just driving along here and I looked over and I'm like, look at them palm trees. And I'm like, wait a minute, those aren't palm trees. Those are cell towers disguised to look like palm trees. Right? It's not just one, it's two. And then they got real palm trees next to it to try to fool people and then look what is next to the water tank for this town they're microwaving or radiating whatever you want uh, the water and look at this there's a little thing right there right radio frequencies yeah Come over here to the town of Miranda and drink our water. We microwave it.